Weather behave for the first week of back to school. This heat is absolutely dangerous and many area students have practice outside in this weather. St. Louis 11 meteorologist Jamie Travers spoke with a high school athletic director about how they keep their athletes safe. She joins us live this afternoon with more Jamie. Yes, well, Mike, as you mentioned, temperatures and heat index readings are all reaching dangerous levels across the St. Louis region as high school fall sports ramp up. So area schools follow state guidelines and they do that while continuing to prepare for the upcoming season. The coaches have been ready for this and they've been communicating with the kids about staying hydrated and, and making sure they do things on the front end. We're limiting some practice times and we're taking additional water breaks and making sure that safety's first. To ensure their student safety, they measure the wet bulb globe temperature based on that number. They follow regulations, whether that means practice times are limited or kids have to stay inside. It's cut and dry. Here it is and there, there's the facts behind it. It gives us the evidence and uh, that's what we go by. Lindbergh High School Athletic Director Scott Lucci check takes wet bulb globe readings throughout the day on the school's various fields since the temperature can vary based on surface type. Gives us a little bit different reading there so that's not just all, all exactly the same across the board but uh, this is a little bit more accurate of where we are on campus. And above all safety comes first for those outdoors they'll be monitored closely and the trainers have a dunk tank nearby in case of a heat related emergency. They all care about their kids they care about uh, what's what's best and uh, they want to win don't get me wrong they're going to try to push their kids and, and they want them to be tough and we don't want you know kids to not be tough out on the field but there's a difference between being tough and just not being smart and all our coaches are smart and they're going to take care of their kids and the players are appreciative of not having to endure the heat unnecessarily we use this so we can still have many opportunities to hit and these batting cages are a great resource for that so we can work on our improvement on the game and we can do this inside staying safe without the heat instead of being out on the field and today's wet bulb globe temperature out on the field was about 89 degrees, which, which meant football players could practice outdoors with extra water breaks and with their half shells only. They're above 92 with the wet bulb globe temperature. If it's above 92, that means all the students would have to stay indoors. Reporting live from Lindbergh High School, Peter Alba to Shamie Travers, St. Louis 11 News.